marked out the leg and we know uh, exactly where the anatomy is. So we're going to go ahead and make a small little incision and start the surgery. Here we go. The next step here is to make sure that once we have the guide wire in place, that we're going to use this to ream basically an opening into the bone where the nail is going to be going through. Now we're at a point where we're measuring where exactly we're going to cut the bone. So we have uh, confirmed on, uh, on x-ray where it's going to be. So we're going to make a few little drill holes there to allow ventilation during the reaming process to so get good seating of the bone for the length of it. Osteotomy site has been identified. We've drilled all our holes and now we're going to ream the uh, femoral canal. And this is going to be helping us to seed those uh, nice stem cells right where we want them. Ready to put in our nail here. So the, re the canal is all ready. Uh, we're testing out the nail, making sure it's nice and strong. So this is our stride nail. It's the 10 millimeter nail, which is still very, very strong. Uh, so this is going to go right above the osteotomy site. We're going to complete the osteotomy and then slide it across. So the nail is in now and so across the osteotomy site, we've already completed our osteotomy. Uh, sorry, we've already completed the osteotomy and the nail is across the osteotomy site. So now we're just going to stabilize the nail with two screws above and two screws down distally. Currently we're in the middle of doing the lengthening, so this actually tests the nail to make sure that it's properly functioning and so we're going to give the patient a one millimeter of length intra-op. Uh, again, that's to check to make sure that the nail is functioning properly. And over here, this little opening, that's where I release the IT band. This is going to help with the patient's lengthening as well as walking a lot more normally afterwards. We just finished lengthening the nail and checking to make sure that it functions properly so everything is good to go. And now we're just going to close it up, wash out all the wounds, and then we're going to get started on the other side. Stick around.